Hi everyone, how are you doing? I hope you're having a fabulous day. So today we're opening not only a brand new subscription to our channel, but a brand new type of subscription box. We are opening the Unplugged Book Box, and this is the Summer Solstice Box, and I am so excited. I have never opened a book subscription on our channel, and I have opened a lot of boxes. I think I've had like 370 videos filmed or something like that, and that one was about books. And I'm really trying to get back into reading. I was such a reader growing up. When I was a kid, I read like a book a day, it seems like. I had to just fly through them. I loved books. I never really was allowed to watch TV, and I think that helped. Uh, and then, you know, you get older and you're like forced to read in school and stuff and then it becomes less desirable. But now that I'm getting older and I have more free time and it's summer, I want to get back into reading more. So I thought this would be so perfect. So unplugged book box. I have no idea what books are in here. Uh, so like with any new subscription boxes, I pulled up their website so we can learn a little bit more about it. Unplugged Book Box is available on CrateJoy. I'm a huge fan of CrateJoy, so that is awesome. They offer two different subscription options. They have the um, Adult Fiction Monthly Box and the Young Adult Monthly Book Box. Each month will feature exciting new adult fiction paperback or hardcover releases with monthly seasonal self-care themes. Inside each box will be four to six high quality bookish self-care goodies and novelty products. Subscriptions are already new on the 15th of each month, uh, and there are there is international shipping available, which is super awesome. You know what I was thinking? Like, do any of you guys get this? Or if you guys are interested in a book subscription, I think it would be so fun to do a book club. So we can open this up and see what the books are all about and stuff like that, but let me know. Are any of you guys interested in doing a book club with me? I know I was talking to one friend about it, and they were, but I would love to have more people join us. Uh, so that would be so fun. I just want to remember to ask you guys, before I started filming, I thought about it. I was like, that is such a good idea. So let me know if you guys think it's a good idea, too. But anyways, let's get unboxing and see what we have inside. And of course, I will leave the link to this box in the description box uh, below. And there is like a code, it looks like if you sign up for a three, six or 12 month subscription plan, you get an additional 10% off. And usually you get like a little discount anyways. But when you subscribe, subscribe for longer than one month. So when I open it up, this is what I see. And it looks like there is a quote on the box. Let's see. It says, yet sunshine brightens after rain. The darkness comes and goes again. So solace follows bitter pain as season wax and wane. Elizabeth Akers Allen. And then it looks like there is a card on top, and then everything else is enclosed in some tissue wrapping. So let's see what it says. Summer Solstice Box, June 2019, Create Your Own Sunshine, Unplugged Book Box. So that is a card. And on the back, it looks like it gives information on everything that's inside. It says spoiler info and photo challenge. Uh, information on this month's box and fun photo challenge. Post the photo prompts on Instagram on the dates listed. Oh, that's really fun. So they have like a challenge. Um, and on June 20th, you're supposed to do a full unboxing photo to show off your box contents. So I think today's the 18th, so I've got some time. So that's cool. I'm not going to read everything right now because it said spoiler info, so I'll refer to that as we go through the unboxing. Oh, so on top, it looks like it's like the self-care items. So the first thing I see is a sugar scrub. This is um, by Typewriter Hearts. Uh, unplugged exclusive pomegranate and sass sugar scrub. Awesome. You guys know I love to exfoliate and stuff like that. I absolutely love that there's a self-care component to this book because like when I think of reading I kind of like include that in self-care because I feel like that when I think of like reading with a good book like taking a bath like being all cozy in bed you know relaxing like me time you know. <laughs> so let's see what this smells like. Mmm this smells good. Very fruity. And it definitely is a sugar scrub. So let's read about it. So the, um, oh, I think I said the brand right. It's the Baz Grim Pitch Sugar Scrub. Um, Baz Grim Pitch of Carry On Rainbow Rowell was a misunderstood character from the first page. He didn't let that bother him, though. He created his own sunshine at Watford with Simon. The fresh scent reminds us of Buzz, Baz's sharp personality. It was made for Unplugged by Typewriter Hearts. Oh, I wonder, this must like go with the book maybe? Okay, so it is made by Typewriter Hearts, but it's the Baz Grim Pitch Sugar Scrub. And Bam Grim Pitch seems to be a character. 
So this is cool. I guess we'll see. <laughs> Ooh, what's this? Love is love is love. The shower steamer is made exclusively for our unplugged book box by Bubble Princess. I love shower steamers. I definitely take more showers than I do baths, so I think the idea of that is so awesome. And I know a lot of people, like especially people that live in like smaller apartments in big cities and stuff, they don't have baths. So a shower steamer is awesome to put in here. And it says, love is love is love. This shower steamer will help you feel some self-love as it clears sinuses and makes your shower more enjoyable. Love is love. Love yourself first. Remember to love with an open heart. It was made for Unplugged by Bubble Princess. Use code UNPLUG78 to get free shipping from our shop. Awesome. So this is from an Etsy shop, which is super cool. If you guys want a code or anything, just leave a comment down below. And then we have some tea. Awesome. This is by Riddles Tea Shop and Curiosity, the Gray, the Gray Warren Forest Berries and Flowers, an Unplugged Book Box exclusive tea fund. I love how these are all exclusive items. And like you could see that loose tea in the back. So the Grey Warren Tea, uh, Ronin from the Raven Cycle by Maggie St Steif Vader was a Grey Warren uh, supernatural entity that could bring things to life from dreams. Ronan was a tough character that had to find his own sunshine through his dreams in Adam. This yummy caffeine-free tea was made exclusively for Unplugged by Riddle's Tea Shop. So I think what I'm reading probably doesn't make a lot of sense just right now because it has to do with the books we're reading, which I think is super cool. And then here's a little pouch that says Shine Bright. Super cute. You can use this like hold makeup, pencil, pen, whatever you want to do with it. And it says, Shine Bright Pouch. Create your own sunshine with this gorgeous pouch by Novel Ground. It was made exclusively for unplugged store bookish goodies inside. I think it's so cool. Everything is so exclusive. Oh, and there is something in here that says the sugar scrub ingredients. It is vegan friendly and cruelty free. So I'm not sure if you guys can read that, but it looks like it's only made out of pure cane sugar, almond and coconut oil, vitamin E oil, and hand blended essential oils. Awesome. Oh, what is this? Simon and Blue's Oreo Smoothie. Um, Simon and Blue of Simon vs. the Homo Sapiens Agenda bonded over their shared love of Oreos. They certainly created their own sunshine through the adversity they faced at school. Enjoy this high protein frozen treat that is packed with vision supporting vitamin A, cancer preventing vitamin D and folate. So they gave you some instructions to make an Oreo smoothie and that sounds like super good. And then on the back it looks like there is a playlist. So I love when boxes include like little special things like this, like activities to do and playlists. That's cool. I wonder if you can like find this somewhere. Yeah, it said find us on Spotify. So you can either like look up these songs yourself or go and just get their Spotify playlist. So that's super awesome. And that looks like we have book in here. Let's see what we got. So this is Like a Love Story by Abdi Nazmian. It says, for warriors, divas, artists, and queens, activists, trendsetters, and anyone searching for the courage to be themselves. That is like a love quote. So I want this is probably to do with like uh, it being Pride Month maybe? Because this is a love letter to queerness, self-expression, and individuality, also Madonna, that never shies away from the ever-present fear within the queer community of late 80s New York. Like a love story made me feel so full of hope, love, courage, pride, and awe for the many people who fought for love and self-expression in the face of discrimination, cruelty, and death. A book for warriors, divas, artists, queens, individuals, activists, trendsetters, and anyone searching for the courage to be themselves. This is so awesome. I think the book looks super cool, but this is super fitting. Um, so it says the retail value of this book is $17.99 US or $21.99 Canadian. And there is a little note in here. Cool. So there's something in here. Let's look. Um, oh my gosh, there's a, um, it's signed by the author, but it's on a sticker. So you get to choose whether or not you want it in the book. So I think that's a really uh, neat thing. Uh, and then here's a note from the author as well. It says, Dear Reader, the book you hold in your hands is a story I have been wanting to tell since I was a teenager myself. It's a deeply personal story about the power of love in the face of shame, fear, and injustice. Reza, Judy, and Ant um, have lived inside me for so long, and now I share them with you with all my heart and soul. 
It's so nice that they include this. And this is like an actual signature and not just a copy. I'll definitely put it in the book. I, I like that they give you the option though, because some people might not want any markings in their book, maybe. Um, but here, let me read the insert that says the actual description. It's 18 or it's 1989 in New York City, and for three teens, the world is changing. Reza is an Iranian boy who has just moved to the city with his mother to live with his stepfather and stepbrother. He's terrified that someone will guess the truth he can barely acknowledge about himself. Reza know, knows he's gay, but all he knows of gay life are media's images of men dying of AIDS. Judy is an aspiring fashion designer who worships her uncle Stephen, a gay man with AIDS who devotes his time to activism as a member of, AC, er, a member of ACT UP. Judy has never imagined finding romance until she falls for Reza and they start dating. Art is Judy's best friend, their school's only out and proud teen. He'll never be who his conservative parents want him to be, so he rebels by documenting the AIDS crisis through his photographs. As Reza and Art grow closer, Reza struggles to find a way out of his deception that won't break Judy's heart and destroy the most meaningful friendship he's ever known. This is a big-hearted, sprawling epic about friendship and love and the revolutionary act of living life to the fullest in the face of impossible odds. I am really excited to read this, and I love that we got this in June during Pride Month. I think this is going to be a great book. This is so awesome. What do you guys think? Let me see if there's anything else in here. There is something wrapped up in here. I'm not sure what this is. Let's see. Oh, it's like a little pin. Let me take it out of the bag. This is cool. Can you guys see that? I think it's focused. Awesome. And then there's a piece of paper. It looks like it gives a spoiler for the next um, month. So it says, Unplug Book Box Announcement. Mystery boxes are now available in our shop. And on the other side, it looks like it gives um, the theme for the young adult fiction for July. It says, Stars are only visible in darkness. So that is a sneak peek of the theme for next month. So let's do a quick recap. So we have Like a Love Story, the book, and then we have items that have to do with self-care and self-love. So we have the sugar scrub, some tea, a shower steamer. Uh, we have that playlist as well as the smoothie recipe and the shine bright little bag. Is, I like how it's actually like a bright, shiny label. And then we have that pin. So you guys have to let me know your thoughts down below. Um, are you guys interested in seeing more type of book content on our channel? Uh, I love to hear from you because your thoughts matter. I consider this our channel. So definitely leave your comments down below. I am very much looking forward to reading this book. Let me know if you would like to join me. But anyways, thank you so much for being here and unboxing with me. I hope you guys are having a great day, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!